today on Casino Cousins Slots. All right, all you casino cousins out there, uh, we're going to play Dragon Train again. I have a couple uh, updates on the litigation that's going on, so we're going to play this while we have the chance. I'm going to explain them to you. All right, so uh, we're going to start off with what did pretty well for us last time, the dollar uh, denom three lines. See how this goes. Um, so a couple updates that we have is uh, actually Light and Wonder has begun removing the Dragon Train slots from casinos uh, in accordance with their Supreme, Supreme Court order. Uh, so there is a chance that you are starting to see them go missing. Um, and the interesting number I found, guess, Dave, how many nationwide Dragon Train machines are in North America? In North America? Yeah. Because is the United States is the only place they're getting banned, right? Uh, or is it... They make it seem that way. Yeah, that's what I thought I read. But I'm going to guess 1,500. 2,200. Ooh. Yeah, that's a lot of machines. Um, so, yeah, but the funny thing is that Light and Wonder is already working on Dragon Train version 2.0. 2.0, yeah. Which, that's interesting. Because it would have to be a like radically different game right for whatever is the problem now to not be the problem in the next game right but obviously they're not okay. changing the name so that's not changing other than that's the 2.0 okay. i'm assuming there's the train gonna still be there the fortune 8 because i mean as i mistakenly called it the first time we ever filmed money, money it, train i called it money train which i think is a much better name because well, the train does have a dragon head on it it does but that's the only part there's no dragons down here but the in train the... is a dragon but like why that's only because it's what they called the game dragon train so they felt like they had to stick a dragon on the front well, of the train i get it so but like, the funny part is that they're already working on a, a the next version of it right and they're going ahead with it so whatever sounds like they're prepared the for... ip is not going to be in that one somehow it's like they're prepared to lose it sounds like i, I guess well the funny thing is in in doing all this research research and looking this up it feels to me that they're doing the appeal process mm -hmm. But it sounds like they're doing it because they feel like just for publicity's sake they have to. Yeah. But they're not expecting to win. They're, eh, we'll just take them all off the shelf, blah, blah, whatever. It doesn't matter. Right. Which is funny to me. You know, it kind of is telling that they know something was amiss. Right. You know, uh, which is also funny because uh, the Light and Wonder CEO is Matt Wilson. And he said that the designer of Dragon Train is no longer with the company. Oh, oh this will be a decent hit. But he didn't say whether he came from aristocrats or not. No, but <laughs> but there are two designers of Dragon Train that used to work for aristocrat ah. that came over to Dragon. And on top of that, those two designers were designers for Dragon Link. Whoo! That so, sounds uh, pretty suspicious. It does, but I came from, uh, I'm a mechanic, a technician for everyone out there, and I worked for Rivian. I went to work for them. Uh, and the electric, the pure electric car market, Tesla, Rivian, Lucid, yeah. pretty much those are the big three. And we share, we share employees, they get passed around like cheap hookers, like seriously. Like when we went on our hiring spree, engineers are coming over from Tesla like you wouldn't believe. Then they would leave us to go Ladies to Lucid. of the night, Brian. <laughs> <laughs> we can also change our bet. This is not doing anything. Uh, I was going to wait one more spin when we got down 100, oh, okay. but yeah. But, um, but in my experience, and actually Tesla is currently still suing Rivian because their employees came over and intellectual property was quote unquote oh, come on those are good numbers oh wait we're on two cents yeah so that was like 15 numbers. yeah but uh you know that happened all the time uh-huh 
Yeah, and it sounds like that might be what have, how it goes in the casino industry. And you're supposed to sign NDAs, which right. I did sign an NDA. Yeah. Because uh, I was privy to, because I was there before we ever sold trucks. And uh, so I was privy to a lot of information. And so you had to sign an NDA that you wouldn't go somewhere else and, you know, divulge your trade secrets. Right. But loose lips sink ships, I guess. And honestly, you're not 100% not going to say anything, you know. That's just how it works. Uh -huh. And so everyone gets passed around. I'm sure, yeah, these game industries are the exact same way. Right. So these, these designers... You know, like we've commented before, so many elements of these games are the exact same no matter what game you're playing. Uh-huh. So how do they control that stuff? Yeah. So it must have been pretty egregious behind the scenes. It must, it's got to be programming. Yeah. Is what it has to be. Like visually, I, can't be visually. It's got to be programming. I wonder if it's a bit of, like, uh, I don't know, bad blood. Like, what if they're mad that these guys left and this is, like, their, their revenge or their... Well, it could be because uh, that is what a lot of people are thinking Tesla is trying to do to Rivia. Mm. You know, we came out with a truck before they could. Oh. I say we, I don't. I no longer work with Rivia. Uh, but we came out with a truck before them. And to try to defame the company, because it's Elon Musk. He's, ah. uh, he's, he's a piece of garbage, yeah. let's be honest. I used to have respect for that guy. Uh, but he's turned out to be a whack job. Yeah. And people are thinking, like, it's very common belief that he's just trying to discredit the company because we're his competition, and we got there first. Oh. Um, of course, you'll never know that for sure, unless you get him drunk one day and he spills the beans. But, uh... Yeah, I don't know. His two cents isn't working as good as it did last time. No. But I find all that interesting. And uh, there, the names of the employees were released, so I don't think it matters. Yeah. I was going to bring it up, but... I just really don't think it matters. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, that's crazy, man. Like, uh, I guess they, they, they're just prepared to lose. They know they did something wrong, or it sounds like, and they're just, like, basically going to pull Dragon Train and release Dragon Train 2.0. Yeah, and as we record this, uh, what is it, G, G2E is starting tomorrow as we record this. Mm. And what that is is like, for anyone who knows video games, uh, E3 used to be the big expo. Uh, if you know Cars, the Detroit Auto Show is like, you know, the big daddy. Come on, you gotta give us something. This is getting crazy. Yeah, we're down 200 already. But, uh, and that's what G2E is, and you know Light and Wonder is gonna be asked about it. Like, that's gonna be big news, so. We'll see what happens there. It's right there. Oh. I thought that would have been a lot more. Yeah. Need Just because it's the there. soap. If it would have lined up with that one. Come on, we need to show the people something here, game. Mm. I'm trying to talk you up for your last I, days. I know, this could Which, be the last time we ever play it. Which, there by the way, go. what I did forget to mention, every Dragon Train game has to be off the floor by October 23rd. October 23rd, wow. That is the last day yeah. that they're allowed I'm, to be on the floor. Yeah, I don't know if we'll be back to record before then, so. No. This might be our last this. chance. Oh, I saw the train go by. No, we need this train. We need this to be a train station and stop. Come on, let's hit the fortune whatever. All right, save it, it, save it, save it for the train. Or just save it. Ah. Set the fortune eight before they pulled off the machine. Pull it off the floor. Yeah. Give me one fortune eight. I wonder then, will they have to stick that money into another game, you know, when they pull games? Well, the Light and Wonder obviously said they're just going to... That's actually better than it looks. We needed it, I too. Know. Yeah, we did. Uh, they said they're just going to be replacing Dragon Trains with other Light and Wonder oh, games. Oh, Light and Wonder So games. they could just transfer these jackpots to the new games. But they, do they have to? They have to transfer them somewhere. Somewhere. But not necessarily the same manufacturer. No, but they could. Yeah. They could just, like if they, I don't remember off the top of my head what other Light and Wonder game is off the top of my head. But, uh, yeah, they can just replace this with Ultimate Firelink, because I know that's Light and Wonder, and just put that mm. as a major on a, on a Firelink. Huh. 
I mean, it would get yeah. people to, I mean, not like they need incentive to play Firelink anyway. Right. If you guys don't know, when they pull any game off the floor, they can't just, like, take that money and keep it for themselves. They have to put it in another game to make it available for anybody else to win. Because so, officially, that is the player's money. Right. You have to be able to win it, what's been put in. Right, because it is our money, they cannot keep it. So sometimes you might see a game where there like maybe has a maxed out major of $1,000 typically, and it might be at $3,000, and you're like, wait, how could that possibly be at $3,000? Well, it's because they had to take the money from a game they pulled right. and stuck it in that game. I've never seen one in the casino myself, but one day I would like to be like, holy cow, that's insane. Like maybe that's how those four hundred, seven hundred thousand, you know, what? brands over there. They just keep dumping them into there. They just keep dumping into there. <laughs> That'd be funny. I mean, it could be. I, I mean, I'm not saying I'm not saying it's not because those they're huge. That is, that is when the average. Oh all my come gosh! Out. When the average jackpots were like what twenty something thousand or fifty yeah, thousand for like the that? grand, yeah. And those were at four hundred like outside of the high limit room too. Yeah, just on the floor. And you don't have to bet that much to have a chance to get them. Oh, I like that number. $75? Yep. Oh, that's good. Free spins. I know. Well, free spins are always fun in this game. Right. I'm surprised we haven't got it yet. I was surprised it took us so long to get even one holding spin. I know. Uh, but we're basically back down the bonus money. Might be time to change again. Yeah. What are you feeling, though? I don't know. We've tried just yeah, We didn't try everything. pennies, no. I don't think so. We haven't. Yeah, do 250. Yeah. They could bump it up if we're feeling it. You know what? I want to try something else. $2? I want to try 100 doing lines? 100 lines doing, and stick them with, like, that $3 bet. Because we've I don't think we've ever played the 100 lines. No. Oh, come on. And if we do happen to get the free games, which we haven't got yet. That would help for that. But not so much. Oh, oh come, come on. on. Or something Blockers. like that, you know, if we didn't have the blockers. Oh. Jeez. At least that gave us our bet back. Yeah. That's starting to tease us with a lot more uh, golden Oh, buckets, so. and we've never seen that before. Come on, game. Ooh, that's a nice number. You're about to leave the floor, don't. Oh, oh my we gosh. Got it, we got it. Another train. Two minis, a train. And I'm going to kill my battery if I don't stop or stop or start stopping these recordings. Let's go. Oh, all right. Come on. Six What's the Fortune 8 on this? $12 again. Fortune 8, $1,200. Yeah. Maybe we'll just hit Fortune 8s all around. Oh, God. Oh, 30. Oh, snap. I mean, maybe switching to the 100 lines makes these nuggets bigger, too. You know, I never thought about that. That's actually a possibility that I never thought of. I mean, we did get the train. <laughs> and another mini. Three minis, $30, $12, $9, another $12. All right, let's save this. Save it. Another train. <laughs> All right, here it comes. Come on, fortune eight. I can't wait to see these numbers. I mean, based off of what we were getting in the base game. Uh, it's got to be better than the last I time we got this. I'm excited about this. That's $45. already almost better. That's already half of what we did last time. I don't even remember what we got. 90 bucks. Oh, 90, yeah. Let's go. It can't stop there. No, it can't do that. I swear to all that's holy, it better not. Oh, all right, okay. 15. And, and 45. 105 yep. bucks just in the train alone. More than the last one. And, and a 30. I told you we're in the Fortune 8. Here it comes. 150, 150 bucks. These are great numbers. I might never go back to 50 lines again. I might not. This is insane. This is more what I was looking well, for. Well, we didn't get the Fortune To get that train. These are the numbers I Save expected. It. Save it, Diamond Dave. Come on. All Still, right. I am so happy with that That right was there. awesome. <laughs> I mean, what was that? Five spins after we switched? Yeah, pretty much. That's, That's $300, $300 alone. Heck yeah. That was our starting by itself. You know what? Hell yeah. That was a good one. I'm happy with that one. Very happy. Oh, I bet. Probably should be showing that. <laughs> Let's show them money. 
Show me the money. Show me the money. Show Dave the money. And just there like we that, go. we are very much up. Very much up. So. Yeah, yeah. Uh, YouTube, yeah. Casino Cousins. Oh, really? Yeah, we started it a few months ago. There you go. What was your name? Queen. Nice to meet you, Queen. I'm Dave. Oh, Casino Cousins. This is my cousin, Brian. How you doing? And that's not my cousin, Dave. <laughs> All right, I will check you out how to subscribe. If you scan the QR code on the back, it'll take you right to us. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. What was Thanks. your name? Queen. 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 Nice to meet you. You too. And good luck. Thank you. All right, that was a heck of a bonus. Yeah, I'll say. Uh, and just like that, where it was looking so bad, <laughs> we're up by 200. I mean, you know, I just looked down and I was like, you know what? Let's try 100 lines. Just see how it works. I, I'm glad I, we did. I figured you never tried it. No. Well, Queen got a bonus. Wow, that's like two spins. Mm -hmm. She said she just lowered her bet, though. She just what? Lowered her bet. Oh. I won't get trained. Come on. Yeah, like when I, because, well, when I play this, I generally don't play for line hits or or the free spins. I'm playing for the holding spin. Yeah. So I don't care about lines. Right. You know, I care about the overall bet, which I, is why I also go to the dollar Dina. Oh, well, you can't argue with the results. That was awesome bonus. No, I, who's arguing the results? I'm just telling you, I don't right. normally right. care about line hits. Yeah. But... But I never did consider that it could increase your gold nugget size. Right. I mean, I would say it did because. I mean, it's hard all. to say, but that was only one time. Oh, yeah, it's it true. could have just been a generous bonus. Yeah. That but on the other hand, coincidence that it did happen right after we doubled our lines. Yeah. Oh. Ooh. I'll keep no, I taking love that, that sound. I'll keep taking that. Oh, I like that sound too. 565 bucks would be nice. Woo. And the way this has been going, that's, that would sound just about right. Wow. Okay, trains. Let's try a fast one. Five. We're not staying hot though, are we? Not hot, no. Definitely say not. Let's see. Uh, give a little pause here. Yeah, dramatic and roll scene. <laughs> you say roll scene? Roll scene, yeah. Look at you using technical terms. <laughs> <laughs> Making movies here, Brian. A little tiny Techni ones. Technically. Short films. <laughs> yeah, right? Short films. Short film directors. <laughs> I think I'm more of a producer. I think we'll take on we take a mutual directorial yeah. job job. So yeah. we're a we're a director tandem. We're, but I kinda do most of the production. We're both actors. We write it, we act in it. Yeah, really. We're we're we're, 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 we're just all of it. We are ah. all of it. Right? Yeah. No, no, you would be a producer too. You'd, I think you'd be the executive producer, mm. and I'd be like the producer. Yeah. You know, because like, like you see in all these shows where like, oh, the successful show where after a while, like the actors get executive producer credits. Yeah. They're not producing. They're right. Just, they're just there. Oh. Like, it to like, I watch only murders in the building, uh -huh. and after like the first season, Steve Martin, Martin Short, and Selena Gomez all of a sudden became executive producers. Right. Although Steve Martin was an executive producer because he helped create it, mm. but the other ones got producer billing, which is funny. Come on, we need another bonus here, Brian. Yeah, but I'm wondering if we should. Oh, here. Ooh, those are good numbers. Yeah. Oh, but that's those a great are good number. numbers. See that major again with five of his friends. We didn't do. We did do two sets. Did we do ten? Mm, no, I don't think we did. No, we skipped ten. So we do two fifty or fifty. 
So five dollars? Yeah. No, that's two fifty. That's five dollars. Oh, that is five dollars. You're right. Yeah, why not? Fifty lines. Meh. Let's do it. Right, it's fifty lines. Yeah. And at ten cents. But it gives us the free game, I was just which say. it just hasn't done it yet. Nope, it's only teased it. Which is funny, because I feel like whenever I play Dragon Train like on the app or whatever on my phone, that's what I get way more often than the Nuggets. I just really like to showcase it one last time. Right? Z-game, I guess no one told you, but you're about to be pulled. So if you just want to showcase what you can do one last time, the people would love that. Got to do it for the people. We're the people's people. I am TV's Brian. Nobody loves you guys more than we do, so make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. We're down to our last couple of spins. Ooh. Come on. Yeah? No. And dramatic pause and action. <laughs> and no whammies, no whammies, no whammies, no whammies, and stop. <laughs> Whammy. <laughs> we both got 50 cents on our, on our dramatics. I'll call it one more spin. It's only 50 cents. Yeah. So last spin. Last spin. Here we go. Come on, baby. Don't let me down. You know you want to. You don't know you, you want to. Are you? Are you? Yeah. That would have been nice. All right, guys. That was fun. Uh, and this one, for the record, was called what? <laughs> I don't even remember. Emperor um, something. Emperor something. Um, Dragon Train. It's Dragon Train. <laughs>